Hi guys, how are you? So today I wanted to show you how I created this awesome DIY barrel planter. I'm using this barrel that Jake got me for Easter. He paid $22.99 for it at Ace Hardware and it is so, so cute. So we're just gonna start by filling this up with some soil. I'm using miracle Grow potting mix with some organic little granules in there just to make it last longer. And you're just gonna start by filling up the planter three quarters of the way full with soil, just so you have some room to work with without getting soil all over the place, but I ended up doing that anyways, so it's kinda hard not to make a mess with this. So you're just gonna start by kind of organizing your plants. This pot in particular can fit three of these plants. I will leave the name down in the description box. So you just wanna kind of set them in there and see how you want your pot set up and how you want it to look. These plants are so beautiful and I filmed this about a week ago and they're still lasting very well. So to get the plant out of there, I had trouble with this in the beginning of my gardening phase. You just squeeze the sides, turn it over and pull the plastic off and it should come out pretty easily. Some of the flowers at Lowe's, their roots do grow past the pot. So just be careful not to rip any of those roots while you are transplanting them into your pot because that would be very sad if these beautiful flowers died. So you just wanna push the soil up against the side, make room for the next plant you're putting in there, and just kinda of see how it works, which one you want where. It's basically just designing how it's gonna look in the finished product. And then just do the same thing, squeeze the sides. I don't know what it is, but I just love real flowers way more than the fake stuff. And since Hobby Lobby is closed, we're just gonna have to improvise for decor. And I just think the beautiful flowers, and they're real, and they smell good, and you actually have to take care of them. I just think it gives a completely different vibe to the room versus having some flowers that I know my son will just pick all the fake ones off. So I've just been in love with gardening. I have definitely gotten a green thumb. It's just so peaceful for me and it just is such an escape and I just love the beauty of real flowers. So, And I'm tired of getting the ones at the store that die within a week. So I've just been buying them at Lowe's and potting them and planting them and I figured I would do this DIY because it just turned out so cool and I want you guys to recreate it because it's just such a fun thing that I feel like not a lot of people do nowadays is garden and it's just... I don't know if you guys have a stressful life or if you have little ones try gardening because it's a great time killer and the little ones have fun you have fun and then you get an awesome decor piece at the end as well so now I'm just brushing out the bushes and kind of you know floofing it up a little bit trying to make it look good this is the finished result. I think it gives my room a completely different vibe. It is so beautiful. I just love staring at this pot. It's just gives me so much peace. So I hope you guys enjoyed this DIY video. Let me know if you recreate it and I will see you guys in my next one.